Hey guys, Zillard here, back with another, uh, unboxing video. I don't think I did any unboxing. Oh yeah, I have. I've done, uh, the, I've got a package over the summer, but, uh, yesterday I went to, uh, Walmart and picked up this chat. Slam Bam. From, uh, Skylanders Giants. Uh, the reason being is because, uh, he looks really cool, no pun intended, uh, and he works with uh, Spires Adventure as well, I tested him out so I could see if he worked, he works fine, uh, so let's take a look at the box, uh, he's got some really nice uh, graphic art at the top there, really cool, I gotta say cool in this video just because it's signature word. Since Slam Bam, Armed and Dangerous, and it uh, works with compatible AVEC, uh, whatever. Uh, so it works in Giants and uh, Spires Adventure. It is a Series 2 uh, Skylander, for uh, obvious reasons. And uh, it says, take them, stick them on a portal, and they show up in the game. Made by Activision, and let me guess, this Toys for Bob over here? Nope, just warning. But, uh, Toys for Bob made this. And the Giants logo is on the actual blister, as you can see, as I turn it. Sort of. Not really. Excuse me. And, uh, all the other characters in the water element, they have, uh, Chill, Zap, Gilgrunt, and of course, Slam Bam. Uh, I will be getting Chill... Uh, where's my finger? I, uh, will be getting... Yeah. I will be getting chill. Uh. When? I don't know. Uh. Shows a picture of Slam Bam. Like the figure, he's got the armor on. And then, uh, Slam Bam Series 2, it says... Back and better than ever. It says it in... I can only assume Spanish. And, uh, new... Wow Pow action, which is for the second game mostly. Increased level cap to 15. All of them will do that, and it says it in different languages. And then play anytime, anywhere, and it shows basically someone putting Trigger Happy's toy onto the Portal of Power, and then it just says Skylanders Giants, bring the Skylanders to life. I wish it said it again. <laughs> there. And then it can work on gaming systems, your computer, or mobile devices, which is pretty cool. So, uh, I also want to mention the packaging is a little bit different from Spyro's Adventure. It is a little more square instead of round. I can assume that's with the triple packs as well. I really didn't look at those. But I do have my original Slant Man who came with the Empire of Ice, but they re-released him in this single pack, so we're going to open this chap up and uh, take a look at him. Just to see what he is like. Just got to get through the plastic here with my uh, fingernails, which are like knives. This is how I opened uh, Hero Factory canisters, by the way. If anyone was wondering. And we just lift up. And it's gonna pull that crap, ain't it? And as you can see, the Giants logo is on the packaging. So when I slip this out, it is there. And the instructions stayed in my package, so that's kind of convenient. Actually, we will take those out. It's 
funny, they usually have these tab things on the inside. Set the box off to the side. And this stupid paper. Oh, it just tells you how to do stuff. Some back. Probably just tells you how it works. Okay, so let's... I take this thing off the label here. That's how I get my packages open. I should have brought some scissors. Really? There we go. Let me just pull this off here. And the label, I will say, has gotten uh, pretty big since the last game. This is where I messed it up. So now I should be able to pull this down. It slammed them out. A little bit easier. He does feel rather awesome, and I will say that. Take this bit off. And then the cards, I believe you just slide them out. Oh, that's out. So you move this thing in the front and then you slip the cards out, but that's the unboxing part done. So I'll slip the plastic back into the blister here. And I will set the box in the back. Now, he does come with a couple things. He's got the trading card, uh, significantly higher stats compared to a uh, regular Slam Bam, whose card I have to have right here. Let's see, he has 85 out of 100 for attack and armor, 40 speed out of 100 speed and 35 out of 100 luck. I do not know what that is for. Then 90 out of 150 uh, for attack and speed here and 50 speed out of 150 speed here and 40 out of uh, 150 excuse the background uh, luck there had to happen when I was making a video didn't it? Uh, crap my dad is trying to get a truck so hopefully the music overcomes that and then the code cards changed as well i to figure out a good way to do this. Right there. It has uh, the logo actually attached to the character sticker, looks like. And it says Slam Bam. Then it shows you what you can do with it, and then on the back, same thing, basically. Compared to the... Uh, old-fashioned sticker. I obviously took the name tag off. I do not have the poster yet, so I can't do that. And then... 
compared to that. I, I think they're saving money is what they're doing, which I have no problem with that. I understand the economy is a little troublesome nowadays, and I can live with that. But let's take a look at this awesome looking slam bam. He looks freaking awesome. For a repose, he's pretty cool. I like that they gave him his armor and his smashy hands. He's in more of a battle pose compared to uh, the original Slam Bam, which I have here. Look at the heads compared. They are roughly the same size. I think some characters are bigger than others. But, uh, I think I prefer the repose. Even though this guy and I went through a lot. <laughs> I will get this guy to the stat level of this guy probably within the next few weeks. But, uh, I have to say that's probably it for Slam Bam version 2 here. So, uh, give me one last look at that card. Same uh, design as the box art. Kind of a different pose in the figures. It's the Skylanders Giants on the back, obviously. Then the sticker is the same exact picture. So, I excuse the talking in the background. My dad is trying to get the truck, like I said earlier, if I did say it earlier. Oh, and he has a orange base with the water logo. If anything's bigger, it's the base. That's crazy. Yeah, that the, the big the base is a whole lot bigger, a lot more hefty. And uh, these guys are now uh, ten dollars. I'd say they're worth it because they get higher level uh, points than the first ones. And um, Let's see. They have higher level. They have a higher level cap, which is 15. They can switch through upgrade paths. What I've heard, through what I've heard, so I could be like a blizzard brawler one second and then go to uh, ice yeti the next, glacier yeti. Yeah, that's it. And um. They also have a special wild pow ability. I don't know exactly what that is. I think it has something to do with his uh, combos. I'm guessing here. But uh, other reposes I might get. I might get half of them. Prism Break, Chop Chop, Igniter, Eruptor, and uh, Terrafin to name a few. I will also be getting all the light cores and the... Uh, new characters in the Giants, so, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing of the newly released Series 2 Slam Bam, and I hope you stay tuned for more Skylanders Giants unboxings and more reviews, and I will see you all later.